Gabon, new land of asylum for Kpachanasing. For a few hours, information about a health evacuation of Kpachanasing has been circulating on social networks and fueling debates in the platforms. Evacuation or deportation, especially when you learn from several well informed sources that Foray Nasing Bay's half brother, admitted to the military pavilion of Lome for two years, no longer has worrisome health. After more than 13 years in prison, Kpachanasing's case remains a puzzle for his brother who doesn't know how to get rid of it. The likelihood of a real health evacuation, either in North Africa, Morocco or Tunisia, or in the Middle East, Lebanon, or Europe that would have allowed Kpachanasing to have freedom of movement, has always been categorically ruled out by his brother President. The latter favoured his own option by requesting several countries, Gambia, Equatorial Guinea, Uganda, Gabon. By the way, this is the main topic that has, in fact, furnished Foray Nassim Bay's many trips to Gabon and Ali Bongo's recent visit to Togo, all dressed up as a friendship and business visit. Kpacha Nassim Bay knew about all these attractions, but had no idea when he was to embark on this journey. This is how he was caught this Thursday, the 23rd of March, 2023 in the early evening. He was asked to quickly do his stuff at the Lomé military pavilion, heading to the airport and destination Gabon. According to very specific sources, his stay in Gabon will be under the register of a supervised residence. The question is whether it is a remittance from the country to allow the two enemy brothers to dialogue in serenity to resolve their difference or is it a land of refuge for Foray Nassim Bay's half-brother, the days ahead will locate us.